Hello and welcome to the Philippines and welcome to Jay Park Island Resort and Water Park on Mactan Island, the Philippines. Uh, we're going to take a look around the park, see what's available, and uh, into one of the rooms uh, that I stayed in. And this is, I believe it's a deluxe room. Anyway, you got a key card. You need to put that in that little slot that turns on your electricity. That is the case in many hotels. Uh, a lot of people go into the hotel and, and uh, can't figure they <laughs> go back down and say, my electric doesn't work and my lights don't work. And Well, you, you need to put the key card in the little slot. And when you take it out, it turns off your electricity. So if you're charging, uh, charging something, a, a phone or tablet or something, I believe it will shut off the outlets as well. Anyway, I believe all rooms... Not positive, I believe all the rooms come with a, bite, a balcony, nice size balcony too. And we have, a, uh, we have a sea view, ocean view room. Uh, very nice, very nice room. It was uh, very quiet, and I like quiet. Uh, noise control was my business in the U.S. for many, many, many years. And uh, anyway... The, the, the park goes all the way to the ocean, and there's a beach there also. I'll show you the beach, some of the rides, many, many different pools. Uh, out on the ocean, you, there are many activities you can get on. You can get on the banana ride. You can get on the, you can rent uh, skidoos, I guess they're called, uh, like a snowmobile on the water, for those of you who live in the snowy climates. And uh, even had a, a pretty large bathtub. I've had I've had a couple of uh, condominiums. It's, it's almost seven years. I've had been in six condominiums. I've had a couple of bathtubs that were quite small, very difficult to use. But this was actually fairly large. And there's a, a phone in case uh, any of the world's presidents need to call me while I'm busy and seek my advice. Got a fire extinguisher there. You've got a little fridge and a couple bottles of water. What we're in there, you've got a coffee maker, a little bit of instant coffee, some tea, and you've got a safe, a safe, very important, and a couple of robes. Uh, now, a couple of people, a couple of people, not that I know, put those robes on, thought they were going to take a stroll, uh, stroll around the park, and they were stopped and said, uh, ma'am, sir, uh, those are for use inside your room, not for strolling around the park. This is about uh, three and a half months after Super Typhoon Odette, international name Rai, came through this area, did a lot of damage. Uh, they have pretty much got everything up and running. Everything's open again. There was one little spot down by the ocean. I'll show you that later. It still had a little bit of damage. You're, you weren't allowed in this one small little area. But, uh, yeah, that, that super typhoon did some major, major damage. And you've got a, a number of different pools along here. Uh, some just for wading, some deeper. Uh, they, they, they start in one area fairly shallow for, for kids. And then they have a, a deeper area as well. And, of course, you can uh, rent various types of uh, inner tubes, uh, floaties, different things, I believe. I believe didn't check out all that information. Now, we got in on a very good special promotion. And we actually, we were there for a buffet the night before, and then we stayed overnight because we were, were involved in a uh, promotion for, um, for some expats. I think we had, gosh, about 70 expats, and I think about right around 20 of them stayed overnight, I believe. Uh, but anyway, I checked online, different, you know, all these hotels and resorts have different promotions at different times. Uh, so I'm not going to get prices out. Um, anyway, this is like the Amazon, I think they call it maybe the Amazon River or something like that. And this water flows along here. And this area really lights up uh, nice, all these mushrooms and such. Uh, that's what they are. Uh, they uh, they light up at night, really, really pretty. Um, and uh, I'll show you that a little bit later. 
the water moves and you move with it. There's some people just like here, some people going underneath as we speak here. And just float along and enjoy the ride. They have many different, I, l I looked at their site, it's amazing all the different types of rooms that they have too. They even have, uh, beware of falling coconuts, and indeed there were some coconuts up there, so. Um, they even have some some rooms that are pretty much dedicated to for children. They, they've got one has a trampoline in it. They've got uh, they're they're decorated in the uh, children type themes and uh, large rooms. They're all pretty good size, but some are even even larger and uh, really really uh, dedicated to the children. If that's what you're looking for. They also have yearly passes. You can get an individual yearly pass that entitles you to lots of discounts, that gives you some vouchers to hand out to your family and friends. Um, it gives you discounts for food and for other types of things. And then they have a family, a family uh, plan, discount plan, membership plan, that gives you additional additional uh, discounts throughout the year as well. Worth checking out, go to their site to check all that information out. This was a little bit of a cloudy day, which actually was kind of nice because it was cooler, quite cool. Not cold, not uncomfortable, but it was cooler. And we actually didn't have any rain. We went down, I'll, sh I'll show you the area. We had some, some drinks a little later and by the ocean and there, where there was a singer down there and didn't start raining until she took her break. So we were very fortunate. But anyway, they do have a beach. They've got some volleyball here. And uh, there's a ball out there. The beach is nothing special. It's, it's not white sand. Um, there were some people out there swimming. Before the typhoon, they had a bit of a slide out here too. You could uh, walk up the slide and take the slide down into the water. They have lifeguard uh, out here, and they have, uh, I think you can rent these, can rent these, uh, these little around. things, go paddling around, paddleboard, perhaps that would have. And then they have the big water slides as well. Now, I was going to go down one of those. You're, you're not allowed to have gadgets, any gadgets, like a phone, like a, you don't want to have a phone unless it's waterproof. Uh, camera, GoPro camera, not allowed to have those inside those tubes. Okay. And then I had uh, forgotten to get a towel and and a bracelet to allow you to use all these types of things too. So it wasn't really that important. You uh, you uh, you go up to the top and you come spinning around through those tubes. So looked like a lot of fun. And then this particular one, I think you, you go through the tube and you come sliding into this uh, big container, if you will, and then you drop into that small little pool. I believe, I believe that's the case. We had the evening buffet, Saturday night, and then Sunday we had the morning uh, buffet, came with, uh, as part of the room package. And what I would suggest, I think they open at six o'clock, I, I believe, that can change. Uh, I suggest if you're in a hurry, either get there very early, because we had to wait God, <laughs> 20 minutes. Thank you so much. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> so either show up about uh, early, about six or so, whenever they open, or wait until around nine, eight thirty, nine o'clock after some of the crowd leaves. And this was the uh, kind of a restaurant, number of restaurants. And uh, this is the area down by the sea at night. Uh, very nice, relaxing down here. Had a, had a really good singer, a uh, female singer uh, singing. I have seen other times that they, they have uh, like a water, not water, a fire. People twirling fire and doing various things with fire sticks and stuff. Uh, but this particular night it was it was a singer and she was quite good, very enjoyable. But this is a restaurant as well. Lit up very nicely at night. They got an area right next to the uh, sea where they got some food out. You can feed the fish if you would like. 
Uh, one thing you want to be careful of sea urchins if you go out there in the sea. Uh, I've had a couple of friends. I, I usually wear shoes if I go go wading, swimming. But uh, here here's the area I was telling you about. Lit up very nicely at night. And then there is a there is a time when the lights go out and. Uh, you can see nobody is using it presently. I think they've shut down, but, uh, and I forget what time. I was on the balcony watching things, and all of a sudden, all the lights went out. The staff was uh, very efficient, friendly, and attentive to all the needs, so that was, that was very good. Um, I've read that Wi-Fi is available, and yet we never, we never tried to uh, get on Wi-Fi, so I'm not sure about the speed and, and availability in, in each and every location. Um, people, you know, they're there for us, other things. Although I did see uh, people sitting at the tables, uh, big groups of people, everybody's on their phone instead of uh, having a conversation. So that's always, always interesting to watch that. Such is the human condition, it appears, in this day and age. Anyway, worth checking out, this whole west uh, east side of Matcan Island has many, many, many resorts. I've done uh, over a thousand uh, videos on real estate, uh, cost of living, travel, various things. But anyway, uh, check out my other other videos and a uh, great place to come and relax, have a drink, have a meal. Anyway, stay safe, stay healthy, and see you next time.